Okay, that, well, hello and welcome to uh, this exercise in which we try to solve uh, equations graphically. Again, an IGCSE, GCSE uh, type question, and I've done uh, one, sorry, certainly one of these before, and I've left the link at the end of this video. Okay, and then it says, um, uh, complete the table of values for y is equal to s cubed minus 5x plus 2. So this is the table here. And when x is minus 3, now minus 3 cubed will give us minus 27. So minus 3 times minus 5 will give us plus 15. Plus 15 plus 2 will give us plus 17. So we now have minus 27 plus 17, and we, we have the value of minus 10. Okay. Similarly, when x is minus 1, minus 1 cubed is minus 1, minus 1 times minus 5 will give us plus 5, plus 5 plus 2 will give us plus 7, 7 minus 1 will give us 6, so we should have 6 there. Okay. The next one is 0, when x is 0, obviously that's 0, that's 0, so end up with 2. Okay, and when x is 2, that will give us Eight, that will give us minus 10 and that will give us uh, 10 so because these 2 plus 8 there will give us 10 10 minus 10 will give us 0 so we expect 0 there then that's our answer okay moving on to part B and part B says um, on the grid oh, sorry on the grid Draw the graph of y is equal to s cubed minus 5x plus 2 for values of x between minus 3 inclu included and plus 3. Okay, so uh, this is my graph there. Okay, moving on. It then says um, the equation x, x cubed minus 6x plus m is equal to 0. Where, where m is an integer. So the equation of s cubed minus 6x plus m is equal to 0 has one negative solution and two positive solutions. Now, one of the solutions is that x is equal to 1. Show that m is equal to 5. So all I then do is to substitute x equal to 1 into the equation s cubed minus 6x plus m is equal to 0, and we get that there. So that will give me minus 5. So minus 5 plus m is equal to 0. If I add 5 to both sides, I then end up with m is equal to 5 as expected. Right. Moving on to D. It says, by drawing a suitable straight line on the grid, find an estimate for the negative value of s cubed minus 6x plus 5. Because we know there are two we know that there are two positive values and one negative value. So now, it then says, give your, sorry, give your estimate to one decimal place. Okay, okay. Now, what we do know is that we've already got the graph of y is equal to x cubed minus 5, x plus 2. Okay? So, we want to solve the equation s cubed minus 6x plus 5 is equal to 0. Now to do that, we have to get from we have to get from um, this bit to that bit to s cubed minus 5x plus 2. That is our objective to start with. So now We've got that now i've got minus 5x there and I, sorry i've got minus 6x there and i've got minus 5x so how do i get from minus 6x to minus 5x i add x there and because this is an equation whatever i do to the right to the left hand side i must also do to the left to the right hand side so i've got x there so i must have plus x there as well okay now how do i get from 5 there to plus 2 there. Again, because this is an equation there, so to get to plus 2, I subtract 3 from
from the left hand side I must also subtract 3 from the right hand side to balance the equation so now when we um, uh, simplify the left hand side we end up with uh, s cubed minus 5x plus 2 uh, on the right hand side we have 0 plus x minus 3 which gives us x minus 3 so we now got this graph of x cubed minus 5x plus 2 and we have this line x minus 3 so we now need to draw this line of x minus 3 to see where this line intersects the line of x cubed minus 5x plus 2 so now for this graph the graph of y is equal to minus 3 when x sorry when, when y is 0 x is 3 and when x is 0 y is minus 3 so because it's a straight line all we need to do is to find two points okay now if we now if we now join these two points to give us our straight line so that now is a graph of y is equal to x minus 3 now as you can appreciate this graph because the the line because this graph is one here at this point there and at that point the x value is one as we already know from here so that confirms this statement there okay now over here the the line cos the line of y is equal to x minus 3 cos the graph of y is equal to s cubed minus 5x plus 2 at that point and the x value at that point is uh, 2 point about 2.8 there so the solution we require then will be that x is equal to minus 2.8 now i hope all that made some sense and please please subscribe and uh, have a look at the, the the link below for a similar video thank you for watching and bye bye now bye bye